of the Empire State Building. C100. One, two, one, two, one, two. It works. Hello? And that right there is the beautiful Zara Larson, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, sis. It's been a while since I we know. actually had the chance to have like a proper sit down. You know, yeah. you've been busy, busy, yeah. busy, mm-hmm. girlfriend. All so, summer long. Welcome back to, uh, you know, the hot seat. Thanks. I'm going to ask you all the to tough questions. No, I'm just Ooh. playing. <laughs> Uh, let's talk about like you know. Most recently, I had the chance to see the tour and watching this yeah. come to life. Yeah, and watching you perform your little butt off, girl. <laughs> how does it feel to get on stage and to to let loose? I know it's a pretty broad question, but how, how does yeah. that feel to get up there and just to do what you love to freaking do? It's the best, honestly. Yeah, yeah. If I would pick uh, one thing that I loved about doing all process. this, it's being on stage, like one hundred percent. And it's cool to be in the studio and all that, but I'm in the studio so I can perform the songs for people on stage. Like, yeah. being there is really what, like, my motivation from... The creation like, process of the very first start of it is. That's the source. Like, that's really the source of everything that I do musically. Uh-huh. Uh, is to entertain and to, to have fun. And, yeah, like you say, let loose. Uh, but still, like... Because you're you quite vulnerable up there. Heck yeah. But at the same time, I feel really uh, secure and like empowered at the same time. It's it's a weird balance. The energy but... that, that comes from the crowd. Mm-hmm. Um, it's been so cool to watch the, watch the journey of yours really grow to such a feverish. Fans are singing every damn word. They're waiting mm. for the splits. <laughs> 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 yeah. But, I mean, just watching you come to life and shine and to yeah. feel that energy from the people that, no matter what continent, yeah. like how, how special does that feel for you to know that that is what is in the, the very DNA of what your music is yeah. and to watch it really no, it's connect? it's the best thing. It's the most fun thing. And uh, can you believe that was my first New York show? That's like, crazy sauce, dude. But also, I want to tour more. Like, yeah. that's all I want to do. I just want to be on stage around the world, going from place to place, uh, different different city, different nights. Yeah. And uh, that's how I want to live my life. To do it, and what's been really cool with your career is that you've really been so focused on making sure that your sound is yours. You have been one of the strongest young women in the game. Thank you. And that's really, I know it's so important to you to make sure that you maintain that true dedication to what Zara means and who she is. Uh, and mm-hmm. sometimes it's been a bit of a struggle, and I know mm-hmm. that you've you've vocalized <laughs> that. I mean, it's been tough, but yeah. to be able to come out on the other end and to know that what you've been putting out is so genuinely you. How yeah. does that feel to have to go through some of those struggles at times, but come it's out a important. winner on the other end? It's it's everything because it's like if you don't have that, then what's the point? Yeah, you know what I'm saying that anyone, if, like not me, could do this. Yep. just give the songs to to someone else. Then if you if you just want like. Some you know, a voice to you just, some lyrics. Exactly. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it is it is a little struggle, though, because, you know, as a m- mainstream pop artist, mm-hmm. you obviously want, like, the success with it. At least yeah. I do. Like, I'm not ashamed to say that. I've been very open and, yeah, yeah. and vocal about, like, of course I want to be successful. Hell you yeah. know what I'm saying? It's nothing... Uh, wrong with that. Like, that's why I'm doing promo. So <laughs> people will yeah. know who I so am. Yeah, know who I am and know what I'm about. Hell <laughs> exactly. yeah. See, I love this openness and this honesty. It's always been a part of who you are. And it yeah. is super important that yeah. you stay true to that. But at the same time, you can't let that blind you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I can't just chase success. Because yeah. then I'll, first of all, never, I'll be, like, I'll never be happy. Miserable. Because nothing will be good enough. Like, Could you, you imagine always having chase... to perform a song or perform or, or just step out on stage and do stuff that just wasn't you? Like, how much would that suck in, no. like, even three years from now, right? Yeah. You no, know what I mean? it would be terrible. See, that's, that's why I love you, girl. You stay with me. It would be terrible. Me. But at the same time, I get it. Like, I saw an interview, Ariana Grande said, uh-huh. like, you know, I'm so happy about doing this album because it's really, like, the last two albums have really been who I am yeah. and what I want to do. And... You know, she probably really liked all of her songs, but at the same time felt like I need to do these songs, like half the songs on this album, like the earlier ones. Mm-hmm. She felt like she had to do cause to solidify her place in, in the, like, pop, the world. pop world. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So when I saw that, I was like, wow, it's really like a thing. You know what I'm saying? To have to. Uh, to, to well, But you uh, don't. It's the worst feeling knowing that you're compromising yourself yeah. for the success that. I mean, it's all the success is hers, mm-hmm. but 
to uh, be like authentic. And yes. I feel like I just take Ariana as an example because it's a very good example. Now, when she's really being her true self, she's putting out exactly whatever she wants. She don't have to do this like so crazy, right? You know, the songs she kind of likes because people are already paying so much attention to her that she she can do what she feels like doing. Now, how does it feel for you to to know and do you know and do you recognize that you are that that woman in the game now that other people look to with that same type of respect? Like how cool is no. that? No. No? <laughs> yeah. What, girl? Yes. Yes. I don't know. I don't feel like you know what's like sad is that I don't feel like I I'll ever feel that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because you're going to be working towards it, for sure. I'm going to be working towards it forever. And I don't feel like I'll... Even if tomorrow, let's say by, like, a miracle, my album's number one, my song's number one, like, I'm doing a sold that stadium tour, something in me, I know I will still <laughs> feel like, nah, yeah, this isn't to, good enough. Yeah, there's more. <laughs> that hunger, <laughs> you know yo, I mean? that's one thing. That hunger, it will always be there. Yeah, it's a blessing and a curse. It'll always be there. I know yeah. it will. Uh, let's talk all the time. All right, yeah. this singer right here is fire. Thank um, you. Gosh, what, what does it mean to you to be able to turn on the radio to hear another one of your amazing <laughs> records being played. Yeah, you guys uh, have been playing it. You've been playing it a lot. That's what I'm saying. So what, does that, what does that mean to you? I mean, in the sense of uh, what does this song mean to you and, and how how important is it that, uh, yeah, that, that people get their ears on, on this on this track of yours? Um, You know, I obviously want people to listen to, to all of my records, and this one is just uh, a single from my upcoming album, mm -hmm. which I'm working hard on. Uh, and I really like the song because it was released earlier in the summer and it's so vibey, like it's yeah. very catchy. Yes. And it's so fun to sing live. Like it's just like, it <laughs> feels good in me when I sing I can, it live. I can tell. Yeah. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Like so much, like <laughs> just there's just it's a there's a I lot, get happy. I think I've said this before too. <laughs> Where does voice come from in this pint sized little? You are, <laughs> I swear. Oh my gosh, man! To live, to live your your dream, and to I mean, do you ever have those pinch yourself moments still to this day? I mean, you're doing what you were meant to do I on know, this planet, dude. and that's beautiful. Yeah. I really am living my dream. Like I do what I love every day. Yeah. Yeah, See, it's oh, sick. Gosh. I want to talk. Uh, let's switch up a little tiny bit. We were yeah. rapping before we press record. Uh, but <laughs> the fact that you had the chance to cover the VMAs from like what I'm normally doing yep. and how yep. difficult a job it is to, <laughs> to rock the red carpet. First off, you look... Am I allowed to drop that bomb? <laughs> you look fucking amazing. Thank you. I mean, I, I swear. The, oh, thank you so the much. Looks, you. Mm. At least I had that. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I would, that, that's what I thought. If I do a bad job, at least I look cute doing it. <laughs> How tough was it to be <laughs> on the other side of the red carpet talking to uh, some of the so biggest tough. stars that were there? And did you did you freak out a little bit over? Is there anyone in the game still that you were like, damn, dude, I can't I mean, believe I'm standing here talking to fill in the blank? I I love talking to J Balvin and Bad Bunny. Wow. Yeah. They were probably my favorite interview of the night because okay. they're just so easygoing, giggly, like yeah. good mood. Happy to be there. Yeah. Like the it was, was right. it was definitely such a good time uh, talking to them. But, you know, you're like, I did freak out a bit seeing like Taylor Swift walk yeah, yeah. by. You know what I mean? Like, oh, oh my God, she's really there. <laughs> uh Wow, she's a real person, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, Cardi B wasn't on the carpet, but seeing her in the audience mm -hmm. uh, was great. And, uh, of course, DJ Khaled stopped by for a quick chat. Love but, him. But Assad, Positivity. I didn't see Assad in the I building, know. no, man. He, he had first day in school. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It I was, was like, like, where's the executive producer? <laughs> yeah. You need him, Khaled. You, need you know him. you need him. Meg, Megan the Stallion. Yep. Ooh, I love her. Has it been a hot girl summer for you, girl? Have you, no, yeah. it's been really cold. Really? Oh, it's been freezing. God. How do we? How do we? How do we? <laughs> we gotta flip that up. We gotta flip that up. <laughs> I dude. know. We gonna make it a hot girl fall for yep. you. Yep. You know where you can reach me, Zara. <laughs> Come on now. Um, I know. No, but to be on that side of the of the carpet and to ask the stars the questions that must have yeah. been super it was challenging. fun but difficult, right? It was challenging because it's like ooh, but at the same time, I did feel like I had a a good uh, perspective because I know like. All right, I know which questions that I like to get yep. and what I don't. You know, that's not true, but I know what I don't like to get. Okay, there we go. So Makes sense. a lot of the things are like, 
I don't want questions about other artists. Yes. You know it's what just, I mean? I know, I which know exactly is what you mean. A, which is like a, such a, uh, a classic uh, thing yeah, to... Yeah, it's a go-to. For, it's yeah. a go-to. And uh-huh. it's easy, you know. Obviously, uh, I mean... It was like Missy Elliott's night. Yes. So you could ask about her and like, you know, has she inspired you in some way? Um, but when you when you go too much like, oh, when you just talk about other people, it's like, why are you well, Why are you even me? talking to me? Yeah, yeah, what am I even here for? Yeah, I'm glad that you're, you're learning, girlfriend. All right, <laughs> yeah. so that way when you decide to, uh, you know, put the vocals to rest for a mm-hmm. little bit, you'll take my job and I'll be confident <laughs> knowing that my girl Zara is in, right, right, right. She, she's in the right state of anytime, mind. Anytime, sick days, I'll be here. For real? Okay. Yeah. All right, we'll switch. No, <laughs> yeah. I, I can't do the splits. That's not happening. <laughs> not one bit. Um, I, I want to, as we get ready to wrap up the, the convo here, yeah. Um, I just want to know, like, how how proud are you of the of the amazing, you know, singer songwriter performer, the young woman that you know that I'm sitting in front of here? How oh, proud are you, are you of yourself? Stop! No, I serious. should come here every day because I feel so good talking to you right now. You're just showering me with I'm, nice listen, and, and, words. You know, and I'm not, and it's, it's, I'm not gassing you up. It's, we've been family for a minute know, here, and it's been from my stem, from my perspective, it's been the dopest thing to oh. watch happen. So how, yeah, like how, Thanks. how good do you feel that you are? Uh, you know, you're, you're owning who you are. I'm gonna shed a tear. No, don't do that. <laughs> no, no, I feel. Thank you so much, uh, and. I mean, I'll just try to be the best version of myself. I'm going to eat my greens. <laughs> I'm going to hit the gym. I'm going to try to go to bed earlier than 4 a.m. every night and just live as good of a life that I possibly can, surround myself with good people. Because you're right, like I'm living my dream. Yeah. And uh, sometimes I'm being very hard on myself. So it actually feels good for real to hear like some nice words. You're welcome. Um, Seriously. And I mean every bit. Thank you. Uh, But yeah, it's great. I mean, I'm here. I'm in New York, like one of my favorite cities. I'm back again. I'll always come back. You'll see me soon. Well, let, let's hope because I'm going to throw one more question at you, Zara Larson. Right. And this is where things get a little tough. Ooh. So uh, before you you say you want to come back, I just I'm going to need you to keep it all the way 100 with this one question you know that I'm going to throw your way. All right. Yeah. So I'm we're in the legendary Z100. Z100. Keep it all the way 100. You have <laughs> a library of amazing songs. Thanks. You got some some up tempo dance mm-hmm. tracks. You got some ballads. Yep. It you you cross all the different you know genres. Mm-hmm. Um, but Zara Larson, I do want to know. Okay. <clears throat> have you ever hooked up to one of your songs before? Um, you know what's funny <laughs> that I was once with a guy, <laughs> and we had like a playlist on whatever. Yeah, yeah the playlist was popping. And then <laughs> my song comes on, <laughs> and it was like at his place. It's his playlist, and at first I was like. <laughs> trying to ignore it but it was so obvious that we were both doing our best to like ignore it and then I was like you gotta get up and change it <laughs> I you can't gotta, you gotta holler hey, Alexa please get yeah. this track right now cause I can't yes. get it together all the way no. the way I want to get together with my so, voice in the background yeah it was weird <laughs> I'm not that person though like so so many people are they I mean and Go go ahead, but yeah. like when I'm at a shoot, I don't really like to have like my songs playing. I would like to put something else on. Yeah. I like like I can toot my horn, <laughs> yeah, sure, sure, but I don't know. It just is a little weird. Yeah, to that's me. a little strange. Yeah, for <laughs> especially that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> well, you're still welcome back. All Thanks. right, I promise. I won't have your songs playing yeah. when you walk into the room. <laughs> that's just a little, mm, you know what I mean. But no, all jokes aside, and I mean yeah. every single bit of it from the very first time. That we hung out in the same very room. Yeah. Uh, I remember, uh, I think you and your mom, I think you, got, you mm-hmm. brought me candy. And we had our taste test. Yes. From that day to, to now. I Of course, I remember. I, I remember getting you the big giant Reese's peanut butter cup. <laughs> um, oh, But see, the I thing is, that. is that uh, you, become, you become family. And I'm yeah. so, uh, just so smitten by just the, the strength Thank uh, you. That I witnessed then, and I knew that you were uh, going to continue to be a force in the in the music world. Thank so keep so on doing the nice. thing you do, girl. I Serious. will. Bring yeah. the camera over this way, and let's go ahead and get that smile one more time. It's Zara Larson. Round of applause, please. Yeah. Thank you. From the top of the Empire State Building. Z100.